everyone. So today I'm gonna be showing you one of my absolute favorite recipes. I'm gonna be making my cornbread chorizo stuffing. This has actually been a staple at my table for years now, and I'm really glad to be sharing it with you. So let's go ahead and get started. So I have here um, uh, a stick of chorizo, and this is about, let's see, it's about 10 ounces of chorizo. You can find this again at any Hispanic market or any specialty Latino market. So since chorizo already has a lot of fat, I'm not actually gonna be adding a lot of oil to the pan. Um, and by the way, I have a pan here. This is a, a Dutch oven style pan, but feel free to use a skillet of, of any sort. Um, and I've had, I've had this heating over medium heat now for, for about two to three minutes, just bringing it up to temperature. So I've added my chorizo to the pan, and I before I added that, I had about one to two tablespoons of oil in there just to help break down the chorizo. But chorizo itself has enough fat in it that um, you don't need to add a lot of oil. You just need to help it start breaking down. Okay. And once that's broken down, I'm gonna add about a cup of onions. About half a cup of carrots. And about a half a cup of celery. Just wanna mix that all in. And you'll notice that as the vegetables start to cook down, that it actually starts to reduce a bit, and that's fine. Don't worry about it. Okay. So now that the vegetables and the chorizo have cooked down a bit, I'm gonna go ahead and add my cornbread, crumbled cornbread. I'm just gonna mix all of that in. I'm gonna add about a cup of chicken stock. Okay. And essentially what I did for the cornbread, I made two boxes of Jiffy uh, cornbread mix or corn muffin mix. And I made that a couple of hours ago. I actually made it earlier today, about six, seven hours ago. And after I made it, I let it sit out. I crumbled it uh, because essentially you don't want to make it right out of the oven because it has too much moisture while it's still hot. Um, and you want it to get to the point where when you add it in here, it's not getting really clumpy, you know? Okay, so I'm just gonna incorporate all of this together. And I'm not gonna over mix this, okay? I'm just essentially stirring it from the, from the bottom out, okay? So that it's all incorporated. And that's it, I'm just gonna turn off the heat. Okay, just one quick mix here. I missed a spot. <laughs> okay, and then I'm just gonna flatten it a bit, like that. Flatten it a bit. And in the oven it goes about 400 degrees for about 15, 20 minutes until the top gets nice and golden. Okay, so I think the stuffing is ready. Oh my gosh, look at that. This is just right. It's nice and moist, it's not dry at all. The chorizo, you can definitely feel it adds a little bit of a kick to this recipe. It's so good, the cornbread, the vegetables, it all just comes together so nicely. I'm telling you, this is a really great stuffing recipe for the big Thanksgiving day. Mmm. <laughs> 